Hello guys, it's Travelito, your staycation buddy. Welcome to our channel. Hello guys, welcome back for another hotel staycation. Today we are going for a staycation at B Hotel Dubai Choreo Collection by Hilton. This is the second Choreo Collection by Hilton featured on this channel. This hotel is the third and the last hotel here at Habtur City or Habtur Complex. If you are familiar with La Pearl, it is located here at B Hotel Dubai Choreo Collection by Hilton. If you are interested to watch the performance, book your ticket also while enjoying your staycation. This hotel is unique in terms of design and concept. You will see more of the feature of the hotel as we go along from the entrance of the hotel to the room along with its facilities and amenities. This is the entrance of the building but this is not the reception of the hotel yet. The hotel reception is on the 30th floor and we'll get there shortly. Meanwhile, this entrance can be used also to go to La Pearl which is on the right side. And now we are heading to the reception of the hotel to check in. As I mentioned, the reception is on the 30th floor, also their lounge is on the same floor overlooking the Dubai Canal. This is the reception of the hotel and as you may observe, the reception is unique. It is more individual or standalone reception and feels personalized when you are checking in. On this side is a small waiting area while on the other side is the lounge with a view of Dubai Canal. I will show you a little bit more about the lounge in the next video when we feature the restaurants and other facilities of this hotel. Check-in is done and I'm now heading to the room. I hope that you are going to love my room for tonight. Alright guys, this is my room. Well, let's get inside. All right, guys, welcome to my room. I just arrived in my room and look at this. It's full of mirrors. Mirrors are everywhere. And this is the bedroom, guys. And over here, we can use this as working table. There's an amazing lamp over here, which it says touch me. So if you touch it, it just keep open. And of course, when you switch it off, you just need to touch it once again. Let me keep it open. So this is the working table. And then over here, there's a mini sofa with a coffee table. And right over here is the coffee and tea corner. Let's have a look what we have here. All right, this is the tea and coffee capsules. There are some waters over there and they are using disposable cups. There are some glasses over there. And under this coffee and tea corner, let's go down here. This is the mini fridge. You just need to pull it. See, look at that. It's very unique. It's a push and pull kind of uh, mini fridge or mini bar. Just, let's close it. Now let's move to the bathroom. And it's very unique, guys. As you can see, everything is open. 
and your bathtub is here i don't know there's no you cannot close it it seems there's no boundary over here and it's just open and i don't know how you can get privacy on this but yes this is how it is built so you have your bathtub over here so this part is open and as you can see also towards the door over here this part is also open so that's how it looks like guys and the toilet is over there and there's also a standing shower let's go over here and i'll show it to you this is the shower room so this is the shower area guys and as you can see they are using a rain shower and also a handheld shower this shower is a good brand actually and it has a very small or very tiny water that comes out from this can you see the holes over there it's very small and it just gives you a very nice shower experience when you are using this kind of brand and right over here is the toilet to you so this is the toilet guys As you can see, they are using a different brand for their bathroom amenities. I haven't seen this from any other Hilton hotels before. And now let's have a look with their closet. This is the closet, guys. You can see it's full of mirrors over here. So it's like back and front, you will see yourself. So this is the first one. Let's open this so this one is quite small and this is storing only the iron and the iron board that is the first closet and the second one so let's open this i can see myself there's a lot of mirror over here and over here there's a motion detector so once you're detected then it will just open the light and what we can see over here of course there are some shelves and they have a safe box over here and some drawers over here these are for your shoes shine and for laundry and then over here is the holy quran and also the prayer mat and this is connected to another door which is they're just interconnected to each other so this part is the where you can hang your clothes there's uh, hangers over here and you can just put your luggage over there and over here is the bathroom and your disposable slipper are there so that's the closet guys so let's just close this one and now it's time to see the view what is the view of this room so let me show it to you guys so this is the view of this room guys thank you for watching guys watch out for the next video i will quickly feature the lounge the one next to the reception at the 30th floor and the restaurant where we are going to take the breakfast i will quickly go through the facilities of the hotel as well if you watched the previous video for the other two hotels, namely Hilton Habtur and Habtur Palace, you would know by now that some of the facilities here in Habtur City are shared for all the guests from any of the hotel. I hope you enjoyed this video and I wish that you got ideas from this video for your next memorable staycation in Dubai. Once again, this is Travelito, your staycation buddy. Thank you for sticking around.